Back with Rachel Bloom, most likely to murder. This is a comedy. It is a oh, comedy. Yeah. But you can't tell by the name that it's a comedy. Well, no, it's kind of an ironic title because it's like most likely to in the yearbook, but most likely to murder. There murder. should be a dot, 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 exclamation point. Yeah, yeah. But there so, isn't. Well, tell us about the movie. What's yeah, the movie? Um, well, it's really a story about a guy who was super popular in high school and his life is kind of taking a downhill turn and he goes back home for Thanksgiving expecting everyone to worship him like the king he once was yes. and no one cares anymore and his high school ex-girlfriend played by me is dating the kid he used to make fun of and he becomes convinced uh, that this kid murdered his mother in, in like kind of this desperate attempt to win back his former glory and popularity. My, my husband co-wrote it with his writing partner, Doug, oh. who's a fa an amazing character in the movie. Uh, Doug plays a character, I'll just say he has a, a great chin beard, that's all I'll say. Oh my um, gosh. But my husband co-wrote this and directed it, and I've been watching him write this film for the past five years. Has he directed you before, your husband? He has, he's directed um, a bunch of my music videos, because my show's a musical, right. and he, um, he'll be directing an episode of, of my show next season. But he and I have, we met each other through comedy, so we're writing a movie together. Like, we know each other. it works for you to work together. It's great, because we know each other first as comedians and yeah. second as lovers. Yes. Oh. So, but That's it's, the it's right great. Way. I mean, Necessarily in that order. It's, yeah, but it's wonderful because, I mean, I could go on and on about how wonderful my husband is, but he, there are a lot of people in comedy who are quite talented but use their talent as a way to make other people feel bad about themselves. Mm. There's this kind of competitive, like, I'm gonna use a joke to, to compete with you and assert my dominance. And my husband is just so the opposite of that. He's so funny and he's so smart, but also so compassionate yeah. and just wants to use it to reach out to people. So it makes him such a, a wonderful director.